Where else we got? I love it. Thank you, Mark, for tuning in. Is my mic working? Right? Um, Here's, to, yeah, you can see it. Me, uh, listen, little, listen, fellas, here see, is a great, the here is a great question. Now talk. So I don't know who this is from because it says it's from a uh, Facebook user. It's from your mom. It might be from my mom, <laughs> but, uh, so, so wrong. We're, we're not able to see who the name is of the Facebook user. However, here's the question. Convince my wife. This is a real business and get over here. <laughs> Come on. Come on. Come on in. Come on. Come on. Oh. Special guest. Ladies and also gentlemen. wearing a tracedo. <laughs> Come on. So you, you can stand also right here. Sweatsito. I'll convince your wife this is a real business. This is my wife. Her <laughs> name is Anne Marie. She Welcome didn't think it was. And I have to tell you, number one, she thought I was a crazy person for starting this. You are a crazy person. I'm not crazy. <laughs> We're making loads of cash. Um, but all it took for her was one trip to boot camp, to a live boot camp to meet Mark. So I'm going to give you the mic, which is not my normal routine. And in 30 seconds or less, in a minute or less, you convince whoever that is wife that this is legit and it changed our lives because it did. There you go. There you go. So he did uh, drag me kicking and screaming to Vegas. 29 seconds. <laughs> um, and it was not the first side hustle that we had tried so I was a little skeptical but you get there and you realize that the community and the people are all truly who they are they are very real and everybody wants to see you succeed and they will bend over backwards to help you. And I am very grateful for the entire Land Geek community for changing our lives. How did it change your life that I made you go to this? Because I'm so smart. <laughs> Good looking. <laughs> <laughs> um, so we have been grinding away at this, trudging away at this for, for sure. three years. Yeah. And um, our well over 10k now and do very little we do probably two hours worth of work how much a week. work how much work do i do a week for this business as opposed to my full-time job uh, five minutes i bet he spends more time combing his hair i don't have much hair left so i don't think <laughs> i was gonna it. say matt does nothing matt has no idea what's happening that's true i got nothing i see the bottom line checks and i like it that's what i got changed our life it did. Kids going to the school that we want them to go to, to. Retirement fund is actually funded or, you know, a piece of it. Credit cards are paid. Yeah. No so, joke. No joke. That's what's happened in the last the two years. the fact that together you created something. I, that's got to yeah. count for something, right? The fact that together you combined your efforts and you created something like this. I mean, yeah. We created four kids and this business. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, she mostly did the four kids. I mean, I helped a little bit early on, but um, no, it's it, it and, you know, and it was a struggle, right? I mean, this was it, it was not easy. I don't want people to think like it's a laydown. It's not a laydown. If it were easy, everybody would do it because the money is actually real. Yeah, you can go sell stuff at one hundred and fifty dollars a month for the next five, six, seven, eight years, and you can do it hundreds. People of times love they love the over and you can get 10 and 15 and 20 dollar an hour vas to do all the heavy lifting yeah. it's not easy it's a grind it kind of sucks in the beginning it is what it is but if you get over that hump if you just don't quit you get to buy your wife a tracksuit <laughs> yeah. that she hates with a passion Thank you, thanks Anne for Marie. coming on sure Cocktails for all. The other thing, the other thing I would say, James, is uh, well, she's super well, first, psyched to have done that. By the way, we have a question. Uh, somebody asked uh, how long we've been drinking today, and I that's will a, say it's a solid eight hours. All day. The answer is all day. Yeah. Um, so there was a nor'easter in Boston, so it's been we've been yeah, cooped it's been up all cold. Day. It's been very cold I'm today. Strategizing all day with alcohol in our hands. Yeah, yeah, exactly. That sounds good. Uh, Strategery. But but James, uh, because you asked that question, James. Here, here's what I know. No, James asked the question about his wife. Oh, okay. okay. And here's what I know about James. I know that James has purchased the toolkit. So toolkit. There is no better way 
to convince your wife that this is a real thing Fox than Spence. by coming to boot camp? End of this month. End of this month, April 23rd through the 25th. Can I, I got to add color around that. Please, please do. It's not that the business works that's not going to convince your wife. It's got nothing to do with it. It's that it's, Mark and Scott and Tate and all the rest of them are real. They're legit. They're real. They're exactly the way you see them in the Roundtable podcast. They're exactly, literally, they're exactly like that in real life. And if that sounds ridiculous, I don't know what to tell you. They are just like that. It's not the fact that it works that convinced my wife. It's that she met Mark and, and she felt genuinely that he actually cared. Now, we've tried other, you know, programs, whatever. And we never felt that way. We always knew from the beginning that these people actually cared about us. And, it's, and that makes it different. That makes it entirely different. Literally, that's what you get from coming to a boot camp. And by the way, I've been to seven or eight of them. It lost. Like, I've flown places seven or eight times to do them. That's how much I believe in it. it Did it's, they charge you double when you fly? Uh, <laughs> jackass. Actually, I get a free seat next to me because I'm so fat from Southwest. So uh, what's up, skinny people? I get so, two seats. So th this is an extension from James. This, I, don't, this, I don't do that, by the way. This is actually pretty funny. He says, I appreciate the testimonial. What I meant to say was, y'all in suits drinking makes it difficult to convince my wife it's a real business. <laughs> ah. All right, so, I get that. I get that, I James. Mean, I get it. Come on, James. Yeah, I, I get that. We're, we're all three hanging out here in a city. Uh, we're hanging out Don't here in Boston. the premise of the show, the nightcap. So basically, we started this, as Scott said, three years ago because there's people that work the business late at night, and, uh, you know, we figured yeah. come on, give a little inspiration. So since sure. it is late at night, we figured we'd have a couple of drinks. So it is sort of lighthearted, or actually very lighthearted, but very. the topic uh, or the content is very serious. So I can tell you that if I didn't make extra income selling land, there is no way in hell I'd spend two hundred and nine dollars to go to sweatsito.com and buy this <laughs> freaking outfit. I'll tell you that right now. I don't do that for my health. And actually, James, uh, just so you know, I don't work for Mark. I don't make money from being here. Literally zero dollars. I'm a sales guy for a for a corporate company. I am here because I love these two guys and they helped me change my life. That's why I'm here. That's why I took the day off and I could start drinking at one, which is obviously worth it. But <laughs> I could take the day off. It's worth it to go and do that. So yeah, the tracksuits probably don't help. And they are, by the way, ridiculous. Sweet. And I'll never wear it again. They're very comfortable. Oh, yeah, they're, they're very dude, they're, James, if you bring your wife to the boot camp. Um, oh, nightmare. A lot of uh, content there. It's online. You're gonna have Grill the Geeks, which is where you have people that are yes. doing the business for various periods of time. You can ask them questions. Yes. Of, so, you know, that's the best place to actually give her a, a you know, a, a healthy dose of what land investing is all about. It's real, man.